Hey guys, Toon here from Greengate and our first StarCraft video. Well, technically second because who did one, but hey, this is a good old replay. Game I played against one called Professor, and it was um, one of my first games because I just started up playing StarCraft. And let's have a little look at him. Just getting uh, used to this whole replay thing. So, uh, it's another Terran, and it's, it's pretty good. Just talking about StarCraft, I've only recently got into it, um, for like, and then I was thinking, ooh, I can make videos for Green Gate. It's pretty good because the whole uh, replay thing you can do in StarCraft. So, I had to show you this game. It was, it was impressive. I thought it was impressive. <laughs> I mean, I have to admit, I lose a lot more than I win, but <laughs> I don't know. I, I pulled something out of the bag on this one. I pulled out something special. Something, uh, yeah, pretty special. Uh, initially, what I was going to go for was um, two, like, two or three barracks, rush marines, and try and get in there. And, like, try and pretty, like, pretty quickly kill him, because a lot of people, well, when, like, the games I was playing then, they can't, uh, they can't exactly deal with it. It's when you do six ball, they can't do anything. When you send in a ton of marines at start, half the time they're not prepared, and the other half the time, they're prepared enough. You pull back and you you get ready for a medium long game. So it's not too bad. We were, we were extremely similar. I would start building like my barracks. He would start building his barracks. Supply, supply, extremely similar. Except for I, yeah, I had dual supply. I'd, uh, I probably supply depoted my second one a little bit early. Uh, I usually do it on 17. I like probably I do supply barrack supply, and then more and more supplies obviously. When and then dual barracks, and then into my uh, getting some Vespine Vespine gas. That's what I usually do. Uh, so. Let's watch your name. We're both just going straight for the barracks where I walling up both of us. But uh, it was a four player map, so we didn't really know where each other was at first. That's one thing. But like we had to both scout each other. Which was later on you'll see it was extremely annoying. But then it worked out in my <laughs> favour right at the end. Which how I made my win and I shall definitely point that bit out to you. Uh, dual barracks going on here. Um, he's building his second supply depot oh, and building a tech lab. I didn't get that yet. I started building marines, which was pretty fun. More and more, he uh, he started getting his Vespine gas. Uh, I wouldn't say, yeah, yeah. He's he probably because getting his tech lab, probably going to get some upgrades. So he hasn't got any yet, and he could have done. Could have got some upgrades then. Probably saving it. Uh, I can't remember what exactly he does. I'm getting my marines going. Yeah, I'm just going marines, getting my orbital place going. And the mules are amazing. I can't understand. You get a you get a mule. You you get an orbital command center purely for mules. There you boost. Your exactly why he did it. it. Just If you can get it as fast as you can, I mean, choosing between building more SCVs at the start or getting the uh, orbital command center, then the mule mule wins all the time. It's, yeah. So anyway, he's going second barracks. I've, yeah, I've been producing a few marines. He's, he's getting some orders out. Uh, probably a little bit worrying for me. He, yeah, he is a lot faster than I thought he would be. Uh, to be found, and I was like, oh, yeah, I, <laughs> I supply block myself, completely forgot, and then panic rushed with SCVs. This whole build completely depends on just pumping out my and supply blocking you, just hits you in the face. That's for sure. Not pretty. Second refinery, he hasn't got his second refinery, I don't know what he's doing. Uh, ooh, he's getting stim pack with no marines, so. I, that was a bit of a waste. I thought I'd get concussion sh shells first. If I was him. I mean, if you got more marauders, you'd get concussion shells, just in case you get attacked then. So, I'm sending out a few marines. I mean, if I found him, I might have stood some sort of a chance then. I mean, he only had three, four marauders then. 
my marines would have hurt him a bit more and I'm constantly producing more. So I would have just rally pointed him. But I had to keep on searching and in that time he he simply got ready for me. Which that that bit sucked. That bit complete. Because I probably should have sent like one marine to each place, but then I don't know, go in force. I mean, if I got lucky on that way, on that base, it would have been better than sending one marine, knowing then he knows to get ready. Because, look at him this time, he just builds a reactor, gets so many marines, third barracks. So, I was... Yeah, I, I Because I couldn't find him, and if you're not quick on the, the original build I was going for, which was mass marines going for him, to go into long game, You've got to start using, you got to get a factory, start building Hellions, uh, which end up using your gas, because you end up using your gas to tech up later on. Or, then if you go to Starport, you can start getting that stuff. But I still want for anyway to see how well it's going, and he was killing already. He ended up blowing up his own, his own place though. I didn't realise that, yeah, he just wasted a bit of money. And if that was in mid tech, then yeah, he definitely shot himself in the foot. Yeah, I didn't know. I didn't notice that. <laughs> he blew up his own place. That was rather funny. Um, I wasn't quite sure why I went for this again. I don't know what happened to that marine then. But uh, this bit is not my proudest moment. <laughs> yeah, he he starts picking me up right here. I mean, I'm trying to get about hiding from him but it doesn't exactly work out properly yeah he just annihilates me and oh I was gonna build a bunker there that's why I had so many marines still fun and once he didn't make it he kept his man out right here Oops. they shouldn't have fought back they should have just ran for it so if he attacked me then, like, I, can, he, I would have G'd, probably GG'd. I mean, right, I've got two star ports, and that's what I'm going for. That's why I kept a lot of gas, it's, so I can just get some serious attack. Uh, with Marauders, though, you... Yeah, if you've got Marauders, you kind of have to go air. You have to go Banshee. You can't go tank, because obviously Marauders are anti-armor. So, you, yeah, you have to gotta go air actually kills him though he's still got marine so it's up to you but he's mostly yeah he's mostly gone marauder really so that's why i started going banshees Just, uh, hellions because they took up no they, they take no gas and i have got a lot of minerals he's got even more minerals than I he's serious on spending so i don't know we're not exactly we're not both pros but So yeah, I'm, I'm producing Bantry's tanks and getting upgrades, he, yeah, he's getting, he's, he's only just getting combat shield, and he's, he's had enough resources for before, like a long time, get more supply, uh, yeah, he supply, he just supply blocks himself, so, I don't know, he, he could have got me, but, <laughs> if that was my base then, if this, if this, my lovely place, he would have got me, because I hardly had anything. Just that. But what's gonna happen now is I'm gonna get two more batteries. Uh, 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 there are a few marines there. Bam bam. Tomorrow just can't attack air. Nothing to do about it. More batteries going in. And he's he's got a bit of an army back. A few marines. Quite a lot of marauders. There's not, you, nothing you can do. If I went tank, however, he would have slaughtered me. I mean, if you think he's going, yeah. If you think he's just, if he's tank, if he's pulling up, if he's telling up with marines and bunkers and everything, you go tank. You go siege. But because you have marauders, I come from the back and absolutely destroy his opponent. He, he was about to send his army out again. He didn't realize what he hit him. He, he had a few marines. 
He built oh no, if you put more marines, he would get like counter by running. He already had Yeah, he had perfect good for it. He would yeah, he would slaughter my bank. He would have won that one. But he didn't, so Banshee's win, he lost and he's a beautiful player, I think he's a beautiful player. He was a really good player. I spoke to him afterwards and yeah, he was, he was pretty good. I mean, uh, I think I'll play them one more time. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'll win again. Oh, we. Uh, yeah, we. Yeah, we're gonna play. We're gonna play again because he, he was really fun. He was, he was from France, actually. He spoke, speaks really good English. So yeah, check check him out. I think he's in the Silver League while I'm in the Gold League. So yeah, yeah, we're gonna play him now. Anyway, that's been a uh, green game.